Hi guys, it's May here. Welcome back to my channel everyone. For today's dish, we are going to make some soup out of this pompano fish. I did some grocery shopping this morning. I got this pompano from Superstore and look at this guys. It's so nice and fresh. As you guys can see on the eyes, you know, it's very fresh. And look at the meat. It's nice and intact. And yeah, I'm just I'm just happy with this pompano. The ingredients that we are going to use to make this soup with our pompano is I have here some upo, mushrooms. I love mushrooms. I use the regular white mushrooms. This one is already clean, but you know, I decided to, to leave one so you guys can see how it looks like. And then I use three Roma tomatoes. I forgot to buy lemongrass for this dish, so I decided to um, add extra ginger. Okay, I use two regular size of the red onions, and over here I have some whole black peppercorn. For this dish, you have two options to season your soup. One is the fish sauce, and one is the salt. But for me, I'm going to use the salt for today. This dish is very easy to make if you don't have time. Very plain and simple. Over here, I have my hot water running. So we are going to start to add all of the ingredients. So now we're going to add our black peppercorn. The ginger. Tomatoes. I'm just doing this one by one because I don't want it to splash all over the oven. And then we are going to add our red onions. We're going to give this ingredients to extract their natural flavor. So we're going to leave this one um, boiling for probably at least 10 minutes. And then I'll show you guys the next step. Okay, friends, after 15 minutes, let's see. Ooh, okay. The tomatoes are ready. I was just waiting for the tomatoes to get ready. And so now we're going to put our fish. We are going to put our fish first before our veggies. We're just going to uh, let this one simmer for probably at least 10 minutes. And then we're going to add our veggies. We're going to season this one with salt. And then um, we're going to put the fish back, okay? So let, let this one simmer for at least 10 to 15 minutes. And then we're going to season it with salt. Okay, friends, after 15 minutes, let's remove our fish. Okay. And we're going to put this on the plate here. I just don't want our fish to overcook while we are cooking our vegetables. I'm going to switch the camera on the other side. Okay, friends, I'm going to season my soup with just one teaspoon. And th if this is not enough, then you guys can add a little bit more. But for me, I think that is good enough. And then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add our mushrooms and upo. So let me add the mushroom first. Followed by our upo. Oops, sorry. This is a very good 
um, dish to have, especially in a very cold weather. Now our weather here in Edmonton, it's a little bit calmer. Last week, last couple of days, our temperature was feels like minus 52 and it was really, really cold. So now we are only like around minus 18. So that's why I decided to make some soup. Okay, and now we're going to give this uh, about like hmm, 10 minutes again. And then we're going to add our fish back. And that's all you guys, that's all you have to do. And then I will show you guys the finished product. But let me wait for this one to steam or to boil for at least 10 minutes. Let me stir this one first before I'm going to put the lid back. It's nice. Mm. Very healthy upo and mushrooms. Okay, let me cover it back. And I will show you guys the finished product. Hi guys, it's May here. I was trying to put a music on this part of the video. But for some reason, I couldn't get the uh, music that I wanted to put on this part of the video to work. So now, I just decided to do a voiceover. So, um, I know a lot of you were thinking how come there was no giveaway for the month of December. And I just want to apologize to everyone, to each and every one of you. Um, I got very, very sick for the month of December. And I uh, totally lost my voice for two and a half weeks. Um, there was a rhinovirus at work and I think I got it at that time. And so, um, yeah, that's why I, 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 I decided not to do the giveaway because first I was not not feeling well and second I won't be able to communicate with you guys. So, um I'm planning to do uh, the giveaway this coming February, which is Valentine's Day. And uh, on that day, there will be two lucky winners of 2500 each. And um, for this giveaway, I'm going to make it a little bit harder. Um, my sister was the one who told me that uh, every time I do a giveaway, it was just so easy for everyone to join and uh, yeah so I uh, will make another video uh, regarding the giveaway um, I just want to uh, thank all of my supporters and my non supporters for their support um, I just thank you guys very much Okay, friends, this is our finished product. If you guys like this video, please don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe, guys. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you guys don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Don't forget to share, comment, like. Thank you guys for watching. Have a blessed day, everyone. And may the good Lord bless us all. Thank you guys again for the support for all of my subscribers and also for my non-subscribers. Thank you guys very much. Have a blessed day everyone. And may the good Lord bless us all. Thank you guys again for watching.